All right, you recorded a song called Witness. Uh, okay. It isn't out yet. Uh, yeah. What's the, meaning, what's the meaning behind that song? So basically, it's just like a, a lot of the pain that I've went through and it's like, because I, I know as female artists, they don't talk, there are female artists that talk about like, you know, real shit and like their pain and everything. But I feel like I can talk about my pain too and I can really give females somebody that they can listen to. And so with that song, like, it's just a lot of things like I've been thinking about and like things that just, be just wet, weighing on me heavy. So I'm like, you know what, I'm gonna make a song about it, make a song about my pain. And so it's like, one day I was walking um, out, uh, walking, leaving somebody's house. And um, it literally just came to me. Like I have a video on my Snapchat because I was like, I need to remember this. I need to remember this. Like it came from God, I'm not gonna lie. Like I was literally walking, I'm on some, I need a witness. Like, I can't see right now, I need some water, but like, it's like, I need a witness, I've been doing trenches, like, whatever, but basically, like, whenever um, I was walking, like, it just came to me, and I was just like, this is it, and it was like, I was able to just really be myself and be transparent with, like, my fans, and I'm not gonna lie to you, I've been holding on to that song for, like, two years now, because, like, it was for me, like, it was for me, like, it was, I didn't want to give it to the world, like, yet, so now... I'm ready to like, you know, do something with it. Cause like everything that's going on, it's like a lot of people going through pain and it's not like, why not share it with the world? Like give them something that they can listen to, that they can also relate to, that they can put their story on and be like, dang, like I can listen to this every single day and you know, feel better about my situation. All right, so on the song you said it, you said all you wanted was security. Um, explain the meaning, yeah. cause you know, security can mean a lot. Yeah, definitely. So. As far as the song, like, um, it's basically like relationship stuff. Like, all I wanted was security. Like, you know when you wish somebody in a relationship, you really just want, you want to count on them. You want to know that you can count on them. Like, because the, the connection that you have with your significant other is different th than the connection that you have with your friends, with, you know, just anybody else. Because it's like, you with them every night. You can sleep with them. You can lay next to them. Like, you know, you're telling them a lot of stuff. So it's like... Whenever I'm, you know, if I'm going through something and I want to talk to my significant other and I want to, like, be real with you, I expect you to, like, you know, let me trust you. Let me count on you. Let me know that you're not going to, you know, tell somebody else what I'm going through. Let me know that you're just going to be there for me and not judge me, you know. So all I wanted was your security. All I wanted was you to be there. I wanted you to, you know, if I needed you, like, why couldn't you be there? Because, I mean, like, it's just... Security, I wanted you to just hold me type thing, like, but it's just some real shit, like, cause even though, like, I be making music about turning up and stuff, like, I can also get real with y'all, like, I can really let y'all know what's going on. So how do you feel about relationships in 2021? Um, right now, currently? Yeah. Um, I mean, me, as far as me right now, like, I'm just focused on myself, focused on my goals, focused on my dreams, and I'm just trying to get it. But like, if a real nigga show up, <laughs> You already know how I'm coming. Real nigga, me, please. <laughs> I'm just kidding. But no, I'm not at the same time. Because, like, I mean, I'm doing me, but, like, I'm a very loyal female. And so, like, if I want to, like, hold it down for somebody, I'm going to hold it down. Like, period. And that's how I'm coming. All right. And uh, how do you feel about, uh, how do you feel to have people appreciate your music? It's really nice. Because, actually, I was thinking about this a couple um, days ago. Because, like, I be making music and everything. And it's, like... I had to believe in myself first, like before everybody else, you know, was like, oh, Skylar T, Skylar T, she lied, she hard. Like the thing is before all of that, I had to believe in myself. Like I had to really build it, build up that confidence to be like, you know, I'm gonna do it. Like I'm really a rapper. Like I don't care what nobody says. When I walk in the room, I know I'm a rapper. Like it took me, like it took me some time to like really believe it. And so now that people appreciate me and appreciate my music and appreciate my craft, it's like I love it because I like I believed in myself first and now other people are believing in me and it's just like it's crazy and I love it because it just makes me feel like I'm doing exactly what God wants me to do because that's all I'm trying to do. Like even though I talk my shit, like I believe in God. I believe in the man that created me and that's why I'm here today. Like everything I'm doing is for him. So like I say that all the time. I fear nobody. But God, I gotta tell it on me. Like like please stop playing. Like only God can judge me. Like so everything I do, I do is for him, so do you want to work with any female artists? Oh, yeah, for sure. Definitely want to work with some female artists. Like, um, as far as right now, like, I haven't, uh, none has, like, sparked up. But, like, if I ever get into, like, a situation and I'm in the studio with a hard female artist, 
let's get it popping. Like if I can, if we can meet up, make it happen, I'm on it because like, like I believe in everybody. Like I believe in everybody's craft because like the type of woman that I am, I love seeing other women chase their dreams. I love seeing other women do what they want. So like if we can hop on it and collab together and make it happen, then I'm with it. Like we can even do a visual that's live and just like show other females like we can all do this. Like ain't nobody talking down on nobody. Like I'm just getting to the bag and you can get to the bag too. So, so if there's a female watching this interview right now and she wanted to like get in contact with you, but she was kind of nervous. Uh, how could she hit you up? Like through an email, yeah. Instagram? I mean, just let me know. Like just if you, cause some people, if you don't have access to me like that right now, email, boom, send me an email and I'll definitely check it out and see what you own. But like, I'm not going to lie to you. Like if the way that I'm coming and I, my, my features go crazy. Like I go hard and the, like my platform that I'm building, like, you gonna have to show me some like a little feet, even niggas and females like for a feature like you gonna have to show me some, or like unless we like I said if we in a situation I hit you up or if like we just in a studio together let's make a, let's make music let's collab I'm not gonna you know be on no pay a fee pay a fee I'm not gonna be on that let's make this song like let's make it happen I reached out to you or we in the same booth like let's make it happen but if somebody reached out to me and like. We, I'm a, if you really, really, really want access to me, you're gonna have to show me some, cause like, everybody doesn't have access to me, because like, I am trying, I'm right now I'm creating my own like, platform, my own foundation, and this is not just as far as female artists, this is just any artist, like, I'm creating my own foundation right now, and so like, I'm really doing it, and so like, I'm gonna support you, and I'm gonna share your stuff, I'm gonna definitely show love for shit show, for shit show, I'm gonna show love. But as far as a feature, we gotta like, you know, be around the same, you gotta show me something, like, if we in the same studio, that means, we around people that's making music. We around bosses. We around people that we need to be around. So let's let's do some boss shit and make some music. However, if you like, in, if you're not trying to, you know, put me onto something, like, what can we do for each other? I'm not trying to be like mean or nothing, but like, what what can you add to me? Like, I only want people around me that can add to me, and I don't want to like this one out. I I don't want to say that in the like in a mean way because like I just want people around me that are gonna benefit me and add to me. Okay. Um, so do you feel like to be accepted to the rap industry, you have to get your body done? Because there's a lot of females uh, that tend to get these procedures done to their body to help boost their career. Yeah, and um, definitely no, because like, I feel like just as a woman, if you want to get your body done, get your body done, because there's different like reasonings for them actually to do that. So like, I noticed, I'm not gonna just like, comment on other female artists, but I've like noticed artists like get their bodies done and all that. And sometimes it actually looks really good. Like it looks really, really good. And I don't really don't talk down on them because they they slay, body on point, snatched, everything looking good. So, I mean, if they getting their bodies done, applause. <laughs> Do you deal with female hate? Um, Not, I haven't yet because the only reason I haven't, I may have, I'm not gonna lie to you. But the only reason I haven't is because I don't really focus on negative energy i don't focus on what people got to say that's like talking down on me not making me no bread not making me no money because their opinions not making me nothing so um i'm pretty sure there are people that are hating on me but i don't pay it no mind because i know what i'm getting to and i just got to stay focused tunnel vision on my goals and make it happen why do people gravitate to you um people gravitate to me because like you know i have a great vibe like you know i'm funny i'm goofy like i love to laugh but i'm also real because like I also like to motivate people. So anybody that comes into my life, I want you to leave knowing something. I want you to feel like inspired. Like I want to give you something that you can take with you like for the rest of your life. So people usually gravitate to me because like, I'm just a real bitch. I say it in my music because that's what I mean. Like I'm coming, like that's how I'm coming. Like I'm just give you something that you can take with you for the rest of your life because whenever I leave, this earth, like I just want to know that I was able to do something for somebody else, and that's another reason why I go so hard in my music. Cause like when I, I'm, like I'm only 21, but still like I want to do it now before it's too late. Because like why not chase your dreams? Why wake up and not be happy with what the, what you're doing? Like why wake up and not be satisfied with your life? Like why not wake up and be happy and be like, okay, you know what? I'm gonna go, you know, to the gym today. I'm gonna go to the studio today. Like I'm gonna make it happen. So like that's just the type of person that I am. So. That's, I feel like that's why people gravitate towards me. All right, what's something about you that a lot of people don't know? Um, as far as like um, Instagram, TikTok, all that extra stuff, like, you know, I can be really sincere and I can be really genuine. I know I can like look mean sometimes, like 
Because that's what a lot of people say. When I first met you, oh my gosh, I thought you was mean. Like, no, I'm really not mean. As soon as you say hey to me, you're getting a smile. Like, I'm really nice and I'm really genuine. And like, that's just the type of person I am. Like, I don't have talk down on nobody. Like, there's talk down on people for what? Like, one thing I don't like is just like being around people who want to talk about other people all the time. Because it's like, if we are talking about people, we're not talking about money. We're not talking about investing. We're not talking about our goals. We're not talking about our next move. So what is we on? So, yeah. Texas shit. Up, up in the jungle in the fight, I wanna tussle. Working on my muscles, stay low key. Up, up in the jungle in the fight, I wanna tussle. Working on my muscles, stay low key. And I hustle. Never giving up, don't care how the cookie crumble. I'm the cookie monster, high as a helicopter. I'm drippy like I'm water, manifest and I prosper. These bitches speaking on me, but they fake, they imposters.